Cloche la son infidèle volé, tout coule le drapeau pour credo. La consécration qui riait, mais mon père ouais faut que ça change. The Life is Good Playmakers originally came to Haiti to do a needs assessment. But when you take a look around, you see that the needs there, well, they're almost endless. We have to stay and do what we do best. And we were there really to look at how we can help children to heal and grow through play. So the earthquake uh, bothering kids a lot because it to prevent them from playing and from dancing from school, yeah. When we got to the Boudin camp outside of Port-au-Prince, I didn't think a whole lot of people would want to play. There were severe medical needs, uh, lack of food and water, uh, people were really suffering. But as soon as we pulled that parachute out, kids just all started from all corners of the camp to come and engage and to connect and to be part of a community. It was, it was amazing. At that moment, I was reminded that when children are playing, they are engaged in life. To be engaged and invested in life is essential to being able to survive the most dire of circumstances. The earthquake has caused so much chaos in the community. As playmakers, we need to help children calm their bodies and find peace. Good morning. Bonjour. What's your name? Bonjour. Steve, what's your name? My name is Mendoza. Nice to meet you, Jeffrey. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. The staff are so committed to helping children heal that they believe that their goal is to use play and movement and dance and song to help children forget about the earthquake. But they're not going to forget about the earthquake. Instead, we have to use play and dance and music and song to help them process the earthquake. I was a little concerned at first because of the language barrier. I don't speak Haitian Creole. But I realized really quickly that I don't need words to connect with children here. Just a smile, just a gentle touch, just a laugh, just a tone of voice um, really was all I needed. <laughs> The goal in Haiti is to train a big group of frontline child care providers who can use these techniques to help heal and strengthen children in Haiti. And then to eventually build a Haitian training team that can travel around the country training child care providers. All of them have had their own intense loss and suffering. And when you think about the strength that it takes for them to get up every morning despite their own loss, their own trauma, and to put on their game face so that they can help children to see that, hey, you know what, everything's going to be okay. I mean, that's incredible. <laughs> Now what's your secret, man? Because here you are, you're like the most joyful man I ever met. Really? And uh, I know, you know, life hasn't always been easy for you. But how do you stay so positive? How do you stay so, so joyful? You know, there's one thing everybody should know. 
joys is not out of outside it's inside of them so they have to create their own joys I mean it's natural earthquakes should happen that it should happen problems should comes that's life life is problem and happiness what you need is inside of you God create you with all the thing that you need so you have to just uh, find find it it's inside of you <laughs> yeah that's it <laughs> good man give me some love doc <laughs>